Hi, I'm Sonya and True to Vapors. This is a collective reading for Libra. Welcome, Libra. Don't try and force the crown to float. It might belong to a different king or queen. You know that it can be flipped around because it's a universal crown. So only take what resonates with the rest of someone else. Know that it can be flipped around with the person you're dealing with. Please be careful of scammers. Know that I will not reach out to you for a paid reading. You have to reach out to me first. You can either message me on my Facebook or my website. What's happening for Libra at the moment, please, for it? Show us what's happening for Libra. Keep me grounded and protected. And check anyone that's watching as well. Right, so the white light be here. Fill the space of white light love. It's two layers. Let's do a real quick one. <gasps> okay, let's see. So Libra at the moment. There's a soulmate. This is somebody that sees you as their soulmate. They could be, you could be dealing with somebody that is from the past. It could be a childhood sweetheart. Or it could be that you're doing inner child healing. Uh, looks like there's some sort of juggling. It looks like you could be like trying to do so many things at once. It could be that there's this person, your soulmate maybe could have juggled you. Maybe they were so busy doing so many different things. And maybe they didn't kind of have time, really much time for you. It looks like this is a beautiful card, this soulmate kind of card. It could be someone that you've known, childhood sweetheart or something like that. So this is actually wish fulfillment. You're going within your healing, you're doing a lot of healing. It looks like you're healing from some sort of trickery and thievery. This person could have been narcissistic, narcissistic traits. They could have been someone that liked to win at all costs, it was like a power struggle. It looks like they just walked away from you. So you're healing from this situation. This is actually wish fulfillment as well after this sort of trickery theory. So in the distant past, you've had scales balanced. So in the distant past, things were balanced for you. And it could be that this is, so this is Libra energy. Could have been a court situation or some sort of, um, just a balancing of the scales. You felt balanced. So this is actually spirit. So it could have been that you had a balanced relationship in the past. So first of all, it was balanced and it was actually like a normal kind of like, you thought it was like a soulmate. You thought that it was something divine, like a high level soulmate and something balanced. But it looks like recently um, that you've had really strong boundaries and that you've left someone in the cold. This person's in the cold here and um, you've had to be very really strong. This is like warrior kind of looking. You're like a warrior. And your thoughts are like quite a lot of burden. You're thinking about a lot of burden. There's some sort of shocking event as well. So the carrying of this burden, something's been very heavy for you. So your thoughts are kind of like covered with like horrible kind of burden, burdensome. So in the future this is you being very strong you're becoming very strong this is leo energy this is actually page energy as well so it could be someone feels quite passionate about you they wanted to come forward maybe and offer you some sort of passionate offer because they feel quite passionate about you but it looks like this, this is leo energy so it looks like you're becoming very strong here your fears that things aren't going to balance out. You're fearing that you can't overcome this. You're fearing that it's going to be always a bit um, uneven. And this is actually you rising above this conflict. So things are actually balancing out. You're like rising above. You're standing out and looking awesome as well. So other people see you starting on a new journey. They can see that you're starting out on like a new pathway. This is a soulmate as well that's coming in for you. Maybe it looks like someone else sees you as their soulmate. Someone wants to come in and balance things out for you. This is, this is the healing pathway. It's a healing soulmate relationship. And this is actually like a new pathway you're going down. So there's somebody here that sees you as their soulmate. Your hopes at the moment is that you've got a poverty mindset at the moment. You're holding on to something from the past. The spirit wants you to know you can let go of it. They want you to balance things out. Things are getting balanced out, but you need to let go of whatever is not serving you. Hold up, let, let go of whatever isn't you're holding on to that's not actually doing you any good. So the outcome here is happily ever after. And not only that, it's actually wish fulfillment. So you're getting wish fulfillment, which is your happily ever after. 
So this is such a beautiful energy. And the future here as well, what we had before, is that you're very strong and it's a passionate, passionate new beginning. So the wish fulfillment is going to be passionate, but you have to be very strong here. So very happy for you. That's a cool outcome. Happily ever after. This is the home, the family, the children. This is actually wish fulfillment. So be careful what you're wishing for as well, because whatever you're, whatever you're thinking about is what you're manifesting. And looking at this card, it's important to be careful what you're thinking about. So, very happy for you. That was nice and quick, wasn't it? It's getting dark, so I'm a bit late to my technical issues. Anyway, bye!